is a traditional type of star ornament that I made. It's made of toothpicks and seed pods from sweet gum trees. I'm going to show you how to make a variation type of this star ornament. You are going to need regular Elmer's glue, a hot glue gun, cord, any color you like, a pair of scissors, square round tip toothpicks, seed pods from a sweet gum tree, and any type of colored spray paint you would like. What you're going to do is put little dots of glue onto the toothpicks. Then do the other side. It's a good thing to have something to put the toothpicks in when they're drying, like this. So then you just pop it right in there. Yeah. Sometimes that happens. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. So next, you are gonna pop um, the regular Elmer's glue into a seed pod like this uh, from from the sweet gum tree yes of course <laughs> and you take one of the toothpicks and stick it into the seed pod the one where you had that glue, a hole full of glue and what you're going to do is you're going to put it all um put it all around the seed pod and that's when it's going to start to look like, like this. So, it's also kind of easier if you have like something to put the glue in. So you can actually dip the toothpick inside the thing. But I don't have one right now, so I'll just use do this. Okay. So just put it on the tip right there. Sometimes it's good to have a big blob on there. And then you just plop it in there. Like that. So once you have all the holes filled in, once you have all the holes filled in and it's dried, you're gonna look for the little string part. I just have to look because I um, already took mine off. But anyways, I kind of can't do it right now because mine's not fully dry right now. So, what you would do is you would find the little part and use the hot glue gun and dab glue onto that spot. And you're going to put it right there. I like to use a little toothpick um, to push it down in there. So like that. And I also, you're also going to need to use it to put glue over there, over the knot. So once that's dry, but you're going to do that before you spray paint it. So once that's dry, you're going to spray paint it in any color you want. Like in a backyard or a front yard, like on a driveway or something. Because you wouldn't want it to get all over your house. And I have a box to put my things in to keep in to dry and also once it's in there 
to spray paint it so nothing gets like so none of the spray paint gets like everywhere. So you're gonna spray paint it. And also turn it to see if there's any other blank spots that you need to spray paint. So once it's all dry, then you got your star ornament. And this is how it'll look when it's finished.